An RCMP officer who shot a man during a routine traffic stop took the stand in his own defense today. Constable David Pompeo is charged with aggravated assault. He fired his gun at William Gillespie in September of 2009 in Chimenez and struck the man in the shoulder. Today, Pompeo told the courtroom in Duncan why he did it. CTV Scott Cunningham is following the trial. He joins us now from Duncan with more on the testimony today. Scott. Hudson, the mood inside a Duncan courtroom was undeniably tense as an Nanaimo RCMP officer was asked question after question about the day in 2009 when he shot a man in Chimenez. This is more than a crime scene. It is a place and time that would drastically alter the lives of two Vancouver Island men. I think he tried to kill me. Um, there was no reason for him to fire his weapon that night, none. On one side of the bullet was William Gillespie. Driving with a friend near Chimenez three years ago, he was pulled over on suspicion of operating a vehicle with an invalid license. Something happened, and during the pullover, he was shot in the shoulder. On the other side of the gun, Nanaimo RCMP Constable David Pompeo. Following the shooting, he was charged with aggravated assault. Taking the stand today in his own defense, the RCMP officer said Gillespie emerged from the vehicle without being told to with a glazed, almost zombie-like stare. The constable told the court the man did not respond to commands and several times put his hands near or in his pockets as he walked towards the officer and his partner. Outside the courtroom, Gillespie shared the frustration he had to keep bottled inside during today's testimony. It's been sickening. You get up every day and you're, you're not feeling good because, of, first of all, you got a bull in your back and uh, that's painful enough. And uh, you're up against the RCMP. They're, they're, you know, who do you go to for help? Nursing equally deep emotional wounds from the 2009 shooting is Gillespie's mother. I don't see any winners. I see only sadness. Sadness for the civilian people that their confidence in the RCMP has gone down to nothing. That if you're in a traffic stop that you could be shot because you could be perceived as a danger. Defense counsel for the RCMP officer and Crown counsel both turned down opportunities to speak on camera, saying they would hold comment until the end of the high profile case. As this trial winds down, the defense will call two more witnesses before they are expected to close their case on Friday. Hudson? Scott, thank you.